Welcome to Driveway DIY, where we bring the shop to you. Today, we're going to show you how to replace engine mounts. All right, we're going to replace this upper motor mount, which is over here on the passenger side. In order to do that, we have to stabilize the engine, otherwise it will fall down in the engine bay. So we're going to pop this up. We're going to use this hook right here to stabilize the engine. So we're going to take a hook on a chain, connect right there, and then we connect this here to our hoist. So we're just going to use a grade 8 bolt here to bolt these two sections of chain together to make our chain nice and short. Now we can put a little bit of pressure on the engine and it won't fall when we remove these bolts for the engine mount bracket. Depending on your engine configuration, you may have two to as many as four engine mounts. This particular engine has four mounts. We're going to use our half inch impact and an extension to knock this off. Then we're going to go down here and get these three bolts. Now, at this point, the engine is kind of swinging loose in the engine bay, not completely, but a little. Then lift this bracket off. And remove the old mount. Take your new mount, drop it back in the exact same place. Take the original hardware and reuse it. All right, we're just gonna snug those up for now. Now we're gonna take our original bracket and drop it back over. Notice it is out of position a little bit. You will have to move the engine around to get it to drop into place. Use a pry bar in here to gently massage the mount over, then it should lower right down. And we're gonna lower it here Okay, we're going to put our, the two lower nuts back on. Now we're ready to torque these four nuts and bolts. Before that, we want to go ahead and take all the pressure off the engine, get our engine hoist out of the way. So we're going to go ahead and tighten this one. We snap this onto this on the valve cover, and then the back ones. And that's all there is to changing a motor mount on an engine. This is a generic guide. Your specific engine may have some different features, different issues or items that you have to remove in order to replace the motor mount. Find all the parts you need to get the job done at ebaymotors.com.